topic is about male hygiene. So the first thing I have to say to you guys is you have to wash your hands every single time before you have sex. Before you touch a girl down there, you have to wash your hands because you don't know where you touched. It's basically the same rules as the coronavirus. <laughs> Wash your hands because you don't want to bring any type of infection. You don't want to hear your girlfriend call you the next day and say, Babe, my vagina is sore, my vagina is itchy. Because most of the time, it's because you haven't washed your hands, you went to touch that deadly thing, and you want to put it inside your vagina thing, inside your girl's vagina. And it's not nice. So make sure that you wash your hands. And girls, before he let him, you touch you, tell the man, Go wash your hands. A little bit of soap, the 20 minutes rule, coronavirus protocol, all of that, because that also applies during sex. Yes. Guys, make sure that you cut your nails. What? Why? How come we have guys that have long nails like this? Please, please explain that to me. Because are you trying to scratch me or take, take out the part of my cervix and I don't know are you I don't know are you trying to grip to my vagina please explain that to me because the only the last thing we want here is guys that let us bleed and cause of some um, tears in our vagina any type of ew in the vagina we don't need that so make sure you guys cut your nails make sure your nails are clean and you know that is so sexy and also hand creams i don't know it's not really more it's not really really that important but i personally like a guy that moisturizes his hand because the soft the softer it is the nicer it's down there <laughs> so the most important part of the body when it comes to men is down there and we need to keep the, that there clean you know that especially if you tend to have forest skin let's be honest here yeah? not like we all know that most of the black people do have uh, do have a c the penis silicone size but let's talk about those who don't because we still have the care some of the caribbean some from south africa who do not sequence size and it's fine but you need to make sure that you take care of that thing before it start <laughs> we don't need that so make sure you wash your uh, your penis with warm water just like the same with the vagina warm water no any chemicals just a fresh warm water and also make sure that when you wash your penis if you have a sports skin you pull it out you properly give a proper nice wash you know because we need to make sure that we're not leaving any any uh, accumulation of smack mank i don't know if i'm pronouncing right but this um, this is a natural penis lubrificant and if if uh there's a lot accumulated in the in the forest skin it can have a bit of cheesy smell we don't need that we don't need a bit of cheese in the penis that's that's what pa parmesan region with that's why we have i'm paying two pounds from tesco to do parmesan region i don't need it down there are you mad <laughs> And also this can bring bacteria to us females especially when we do interviews i remember my one of my friends were like say if i had sex with this guy and unfortunately this thing but you know i had to like i couldn't tell you and the next day i had to feel some nasty th nasty things coming out from there and i was like go for it guys you need to make sure that down there is properly clean because our vagina is the most sensitive part of our body. A little pink, a little bacteria. Yo, we we going to sexual health cleaning, and we don't you don't want to cause trouble to your partner, right? Uh, because uh, that's another turn off. Like if uh, if a girl has a sex with you, and uh, next day you're giving her irritation, trust me, nine out of ten, he ain't coming back to you, and you wonder why is she acting, why is she acting brand new, why is she like that, why is she like that? Because of this thing today. So go and wash it properly, huh? Okay. Remember to also wash your pelvic area and your scrotum because obviously when when you sweat it and you go hair, all that thing can stinks and it stinks like as if you have you, you have armpit that your armpit is stinking too. And you don't want that then to stink. And when when you ask baby come and give me head, and then on top of that, that the big stinks of sweat. What type of head do you want me to give? Please explain that to me. <laughs> oh. And also, why you also clean that? Uh, make sure that once a month you do you do a testicle check. It's very very common that men tend to have testicle cancer or prostatic cancer. So it's good for one 
once a month to go and squeeze it to find in lumps, you know, because we want my boy that we are eating that in many cheese. <laughs> hey, you know those them, but them man will come to you and they will hug you, and you smell <laughs> something like that they have it. <laughs> Things, you know, after this quarantine, I don't want to hear on him. <laughs> I don't want to hear that. You remember, have this big man, hey, yo, baby girl, what's up? And then you're they are stretching to you to hug you, and then you're like, they're happy to do few, few. Hmm. You don't need that, guys. Guys, make sure you uh, you uh, take it off your hand, bit and also doing some especially in this period that is getting hot yeah make sure that you trim their you trim their hair because obviously yes hair protects from, from bacteria but if you don't take off your hair it can absorb bacteria and this makes you smell and sweaty and even you don't want that you don't hey. you want a girl that comes to you and say hmm man you smell nice oh, <laughs> that's what you need you know and also make sure that you if you feel like you want to boost it off, because even me sometimes I feel like you know I want to boost it off. I want my boyfriend to tell me, baby, it's not nice. I'll, I'll use lemon in my armpit. Hey, I'll use lemon and also vinegar to kill any bacteria, any body odor. That yeah, you don't want to embarrass yourself, you know, that you want to smell nice because that's what I try to do to the lady. Hey, guys, that smell <laughs> nice. A bit of Dior Sauvage, a bit of Versace, a bit of, you know, something nice and sweet, you know. Hey, well, well. <laughs> do, you, do you know where synthetic stuff? Do you know where synthetic stuff? Make sure that. The nice t-shirt, the white t-shirt, the black t-shirt, the nice polo that you're wearing is made of cotton because that does, does not make your hair, your armpit to breathe. That's why some guys will be, they will be smelling like, hmm, like I don't get it. You might be looking peg and fine and then you have once you agree. And I'll start looking at you. I start looking at you like, ah, I don't finish. Hey. <laughs> Make sure you wear cotton base too, so your hand be can test. Smell fresh hair too, so we will be with the smelling fresh hair. <laughs> also with your breath, if you, I know guys, the guys like to smoke it, same with girls as well, yeah. Smoking, coffee, alcohol, you know the back of your tongue? Wash it properly, especially when you know when a fine girl is coming to see you or you are going on a date with a fine girl, you know? Make sure your aura allergy is on flick. Even you girls, even when you make sure you were if you feel like you're insecure a little bit, slap some chin bumps in your bag. I'll slap chin gums in my bag. I don't like chin gums, but I know that when it's the first the first couple of times I'll slap chin gums in my bag. And I was like, baby, you want some? I don't even know how you dress. If it smells I'm, I'm preventing that. I'm just give you some. So if a girl is telling you it's offering you chin gum, just say yes. I'm like, I'ma slap some in my mouth because you know. Tonight we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a bit like hey, because every guys it's easier for guys to play about girls to do this and that. But you guys need one or two things to be fixed it up because nobody here in this world is perfect, and that's where you go Auntie Steffi to tell you one or two things. Okay. Okay, so I'll see you in my next video. If you if you want to DM me for anything, you want you know the extra tips or, or any natural remedy to boost you up your body order, come to me, baby. I'll help you. Cause me, I'm a fixer. Yeah, so I'll stop all your issues. See you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>